Hi, I'm Lloyd Pye and this is the Star Child Skull. I've been working on this for 10 years now, taking it to scientists, doing scientific tests, trying to find out what makes it so incredibly different from normal human skulls. And we've found absolutely amazing things, amazing things that are different from the star child compared to humans. I can't tell you about all of them in this, but I certainly can tell you one and I will. But first, I want to mention that you can find out everything there is to know about it through my new ebook, Lloyd Pye's Star Child Skull Essentials. And you can see a free reading example of that at starchildproject.com. And I urge you to do that. Now, what I'd like to tell you about in this is just the bone itself. The bone of the star child skull is incredibly unusual because it is uniformly half as thick as it ought to be. Now, you, this uniformly, how, how does a deformity know to make uniform thinness all the way around? Incredible. Can't do that. Now, it also weighs half as much. It's very much lighter in the hand than a normal human skull. But most important of all, most stunning of all, is that its bone chemistry, the chemistry that makes it up, is much more like tooth enamel than normal human bone. It's much harder. It's surprisingly, for as thin as it is, it is much harder. A very major difference between the star child and a human. Now again, you can find out about all the differences through the new ebook, Lloyd Pye's Star Child Skull Essentials, and you can find that free reading example at starchildproject.com. I urge you to do that. Thank you for your time.